I'm glad you came back. I have a very important message for everybody at home. Money talks. It's funny you mention that because that's what Dave was just talking to me about. Dave? Dave. Wow, you pulled that out of your beard? Yep. What's that one a very important message that you had for the people? Hey, right, give me something. It's raining. It was a very good year. What are we going to do? Well. <laughs> We're going to make the best of a wet situation. Don't get electrocuted. Cut your power. Yep, there we go. Do you still expect to get paid? You get paid for this? Well, you only get paid by correct notes, so yeah, he's not getting paid. <laughs> what about positive reinforcement? Yeah, right? Mm. I said lay off, Frank. No, he'll, he'll probably make a few bucks, but it's gonna tap out pretty quick. It's raining outside, and that's the best you can come up with? There's only 12 notes in the scale, Frank. Yeah, but you seem to always hit the wrong one. Well, go ahead and outdo me. I, I didn't say that I could. I, I went to a Christian school. Frank didn't. Well, we're checking out the generator. How are you? Good. All right. Hey, your hair's getting really gray. Gray white. Gray white. Gray white. My girlfriend and I had an argument on whose turn it was to do the wash. That's Dave's new band, Gray White. So finally I just threw in the towel. And then there's Jason's truck way over there with a ticket on it. Hi folks, Mother Nature has decided that the show is done. Hey, positive reinforcement. You did a great job taking those drums out of the cases. Good night, you're putting them all back yourself. You know, you're gonna have a great gig tonight. You're probably not gonna have to play much. What you doing there? Putting on a trigger. Tell all the people in Cherry Pie Land what a trigger does. It makes my drums sound good when they don't. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Frank, what you got on your feet there? Well, considering I'm going in the swamp, I got some protection. Some banana shoes. You always have to protect yourself so that you don't get a W-T-D, a water-transmitted disease. You just made that up. If that in Bio 1, we, we don't believe in WTDs. If that water is warm enough, there could be parasites in there. If I have a cot, it could go right to my head, and I'd have a brain amoeba. What a horrible thing. He literally is afraid of amoebas. Amoebas? Yeah. This oh, one has amoebas in it. All right, I'm going to attempt to not fall in the water with my computer right. and back there. Do one at a if time. If you want to climb on, I will take you over there. Now, you do not need... Uh, I'm sorry, I have to go report to duty. Wait, hold, you gotta wait for me. Look at that. It's underwater. <laughs> okay, Frank, now it's the oh, <laughs> Now here's what's happened. He's, he's wearing the waterproof shoe covering. So the water went over the top of him, but because it's waterproof, <laughs> just ran, his feet are now wrapped in water. <laughs> what's that? You're doing great. <laughs>